the Pro Membership Sweepstakes, delivering news you can use. Hi, I'm Mike Deming, and you're long range expert. So we've sighted in our rifle, and we know what shoots the best. I've made a decision on what I'm gonna shoot for game, and that's gonna be my double tap shooting the Nozzler Acubon. But what I wanna do is I wanna make sure that my scope is going to track when I put a turret on it, which what that means when I say I'm gonna track is if I raise it four clicks, which is one minute, equal to 1.047 inches, does it come up that much? Moreover, is if I raise it 20 minutes, is it gonna raise it up equivalent for that? So there's one way to do that. We call it a tall target test, stuff I learned in the military. So we've got this, and we don't know if our ground is level or not, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna bring our target out here, and we're gonna lay our level up against the side here. We're gonna make sure we get it perfectly level. So we've got a range finder and we know we're about at 100 yards, but we're talking about this is very precise measurement. So what I have here is a 300 foot measurement, 100 yards. So we're gonna basically gonna put this right here and we're gonna run this all the way out and make sure that we are at our 100 yards. All right, so we're ready to shoot. Our muzzle is right at 100 yards from the target. We are going to shoot a three-shot group at our bottom crosshairs down there. We already know that this is a group that shoots really well, so we're not as focused on shooting a solid group, but we are gonna shoot that three-shot group. We're gonna let the barrel cool. We're gonna bring this up 20 minutes, 20 MOA on the turret, and then we're gonna shoot another three-shot group. What we're then gonna do, we're gonna go down range and we're gonna measure to see if that came up the appropriate amount of inches. Remember one inch or one minute is equal to 1.047 inches. So it's not gonna come up 20 inches, it's gonna be a little closer to 21 inches. And then that's gonna give the barrel a chance to cool again. We're gonna bring it back down to our zero that's already preset with our zero stop here on our Zeiss scope. And it should come right back to zero. That's gonna tell us that this scope tracks really well. This is an upper end scope. We know it tracks really good. Well, we'll go down and check it, but I can see through the scope here that that is a good group. It basically came right back to our original zero. That's a six shot group right there. First three, up 20 minutes, and then all the way back down. That's a pretty good setup right there. So this scope is tracking really well. We've got a little more to do to make sure we can shoot long, long range but that gives you the basics of a tall target test on how to check to see if your scope tracks and is a good setup for long range shooting.